like We've undying. We've got offlane and dying. All right. It's gonna be Agling coming out from Navi and leaving Kavos down here to solo farm the bot lane against the Centaur. Hmm. Yeah, definitely could be. And now we see the right click. Vance got leading up, and here comes Sandy as well. Well done so far from the team of Navi. And two more right clicks is all they need, and they do secure the first blood once again. Came in, um, which oh, Navi do right. so well at. When they get on a roll, they really get on a roll. And well, we're yep. going to see actually always want to fly in. Completely blown up. The Solrit used aggressively there. It's actually massive amounts of damage. There is going to be a return kill onto the Witch Doctor, and Silent is going to be able to pick that one up. And if they manage to pick off Funnick as well, this could be pretty huge. Dude, the right clicks. Yeah. So sick. Funnick just hit him. He's gonna have a soul rip in a second. Oh, go for it, Funny! Come on, go for the DK, go for the DK. No, he's getting three seconds done. Now the wish just oh. well inside. And you not. And oh, and look at this beautiful red TP. It's amazing. This mod is, is hella cool. Oh, resolution in the mid lane, though. There was a dream call being used, and Dandy goes in into the tower. And guess what? This is exactly what he does best. Picking up the kill, and now Dandy has a phase shift. And here we go. Wow! Okay, that was just uh, <laughs> You know. Good old, uh, oh, well, I mean, will he see them though? Not just yet, it's Na'Vi playing this out very conservatively. Then you want to do throw out the ultimate, uh, which is kind of, not the ultimate, but the silence. And the ultimate, speaking of this, gonna be coming down in five seconds, and then we're gonna see this, but so far, Vansko's getting him back, and here comes uh, Vansko with a nice telekinesis up onto Mag, and oh, look at it bounce, but immediately cancelled by always wanna fly, what is where it stands off, then he finds the opening, though, three men caught in the glimpse, uh, in the in the call, I'm sorry, and now FNG on the run, Denny's on the run, the hit from FNG, absolutely massive, but now a four seconds done, this is what Silent wanted all along, and he gets it not at all. Oh, and Resolution gets the tower and goes not down in the process. Whew. What a game, Wakey. We now just kick into some good gear. Great rotation so far, and we're not done yet. Oh, Farnik finds two. Oh, Farnik, what did you think there? Just trying to go for people. Mac just smashes him down, and well, the zombies are, are pretty damn mad, but it's all right. And meanwhile, back in the base is. There we go. Yeah. Oh, really? Back inside, he's just gonna die. No, what? No. Dendi really was waiting for back. them. He was waiting for it. So they've got resolution up here, heading towards the top lane, and a smoke actually from Mag and from Always Wanna Fly. Does Mag have the blink dagger up and running? Yes, he does. He's also got a book there as well, so we're gonna be seeing a coming out. Oh. Oh. What's he gonna find? He's gonna find Magical Water! Ketelic Amesis coming out. It isn't gonna be enough because the static storm is there. Oh, he's got to oh roll five through God. as well, though. And Death Ward actually doing some work, so I don't think it's going to be enough for the time being. They've managed to kick off uh, the Disruptor. Land score has gone down. How is one for one at the moment, everyone alive? Still alive. The Soul Rip actually coming out from Funnick, and in the end, they make it a two for one going the way of Navi as Puck comes in and finishes. Three ages. Well, not quite free, of course, they did one a fight top lane, but still, it's a good one. It really is a good one, and Silent. Yep. Well. Uh oh, Danny's Invis. Danny's Invis. What? Resolution, please. Not resolution, I mean silent, please. Now for boost. Oh, the stun, it was stolen. Denny comes in, smashes one, and there's more on the prowl. Solo, you're giving away your position because of the spirits, and he knows. Now he's going for the tether and the blink stun as well. Denny gets blown up, but Denny is still alive for the time being. He can go for the call. He uses it. He's still alive. 222 HP. This is all he needs. And Denny's going to be making this one out. And here comes the glimpse. Denny is still alive. Oh my goodness, now he might pick it up a courier. Resolution is waiting. Wants to find the crypt swarm. No, he misses the crypt swarm. Resolution, please. Denny alive. Now he goes goes down finally he's actually gonna get brought down and he, this is now Navi cleaning house if you use so much time to bring down a pock from a voice with a crit in there as well. Um, just not really what we see. Now it's actually going to be the, uh, the ultimate is stolen, the snap beam, and that's going to allow Vanskull to initiate, but now he's going to be in a bit of trouble again. Used up by Resolution. Resolution doesn't miss the Crypt Swarm this time. He's going to be able to bring down Vanskull. And uh, now it looks like Na'Vi just want to get the hell out of here. And Funnick, he's going to be the next one to fall. He's going to be the sacrificial lamb. He's going to he's going to go down. That amount of farm, and then it makes things like relocate ganks just completely useless, because can you even bring down heroes? Pretty unlikely when Na'Vi are grouping up like this together. No, oh, and now Mac is coming in. Oh, once again, perfect Yule's actually being used here. And but Dandy is just making it happen right now. Mac gets blown up, and the Soul Rip as well. Look at the heals coming up. Navi, they've just got every sustain in the book. Silence getting dropped to the air, and well, now he's going to get smashed down. Robos is still on the hunt, on the prowl, and this guy's just finding openings left, right, and center. Resolution was getting kind of chased by Robos. Dandy with a triple kill, and now he's on the run. It is Resolution trying to run, trying to run. Gotta go quick, man. Gotta go quick. But your tier threes are in jeopardy in just a bit, and. What is there, which cancels just a bit, and 
What is there which can save him? If he goes for the Crypt Storm right now, there might be a blink and by Dendi and he cannot because there was an Necrobook Maul and now it's dead. But this tower is dropping so quickly. Howl is doing some mad work and they do settle for the range Rex for now. And they want to play it safe and, well, I don't remember the melee Rex falling so quickly in a game 20 minutes in and resolution is done. The blinks. Oh, Vance got you man of mans and he just finds another opening and 50 seconds now on the sidelines. It's the DP. You've got to force out a buyback here. It feels like even a... But is Navi maybe just content to fall back? I guess they are, but there might be a turnaround. Dendi, yeah, there it is. There it is. The Wolves getting glimpsed actually in the fray. And Solo, gotta run, gotta run, trying to tether up. The Wolves are still on the hunt. And the Wolves actually doing it with a well-timed right click from FNG. And oh, Mag finds a triple stun. Finds one man, though, only in his double edge. And, well, Dendi is still alive there. And they want to find more, Vicky. This is such a crazy turn of events. Dyer's bottom tower is... Difficult and with Vanscore coming Push in, as well, got, yeah, oh, yeah. what a steal! He makes it happen, and now we're gonna see Funek just beating oh, down on Mag, and Mag's in all sorts of trouble. Look at the zombie slow, it is so legit. And uh, Vanscore's Rubik is making a very ridiculous ridiculous amount of things happen right now in it this really game. Is. He was making the first blood happen and as such Denny was just having the time of his life once again blinking in just doing his thing and well that's a nice yours but can you really run from heaven? No you cannot. Relocate? Nope not there. Not there at all and there's gonna be another yours and this is it. Yeah GG is being called. This is this is just textbook puck play, by the way, as well from Dendi. He is 11, 1, and 12. He is actually responsible for the most of the kills. He's responsible of 23 out of 27 kills. This is, if you wanna, if you wanna see what a puck can do, just watch the replay. Seriously, amazing play by Dendi. What a game! Wow. What a serious. I mean, Navi what a serious. is playing so so well. I actually didn't really have the mods on favorites for this one at all, I have to say. Empire been pl playing so well recently, especially in this competition alone. And, uh, well, Na'Vi really just turned it on for both of these games, securing two wins. And I'm not sure quite how that makes the standings uh, in the EMC, but it definitely puts them in a pretty comfortable...